Yes, people, welcome back to the Rat Cave and a little bit of a different video from me today. You don't see this very often, but I am joined by Pete Holding from uh, allpartiesandevents.co.uk. Thank you. Uh, one of the biggest and best mobile DJ companies on the South Coast. That's how we like it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I've got you in today, Pete, because uh, you know a little bit more about the mobile DJ side of things than I do. Uh, yeah. Let's... Let's be honest. Well, let's, let's pretend we do anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, I am here with you today with ProLite's Equinox Spectrapix Baton. Well done. Right, That's yeah. fabulous. There you go. Yeah, it's, it helps that it's got it written on the That's side. That's a mouthful. Of the That's yeah. a mouthful. Yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, so, so we've got a pair of these in, uh, in, in the Rat Cave today. Um, like I said, a little bit different. Normally, like you see me with a DJ control or something in here. But since these uh, got announced, um, people have gone mad for them. Yeah, um, yeah, and I just thought it would be really good, you know, to sort of go through to show everybody what, yep. like, what, what they can do, basically, like the yep. creative possibilities with them and stuff. Yeah, well, they've gone mad with them because they are a fantastic new line. They really are. There's so much flexibility in these units. Mm. It's untrue. If you look at it just standing here on a stand, you can use it as something that's just going to decorate any yep. mobile set. Any club, restaurant, bar, hotel, you can use them for in-stores, but I'm thinking from a mobile DJ point of view, they're fabulous. In that moment, we've got them on a show, which is just show number one, and it's just going very slowly through that. Yep. So you can put it into show modes. There are 54 different shows. 54, so so many different like variables of, of yep. what, what the lights yep. can do. And this is on slow at the moment. Yeah. Um, can, you, can you speed it up? Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. No, we can do that very, very simply by just changing the speed. And that will now start to go through it a lot, lot faster. There you go. So it takes you through, obviously RGB, but all of the all of the bits and bobs in between as well. Yeah, and it's it's RGB, which obviously gives you all the flexibilities of those three colours, mm -hmm. but also within those fifty four program modes is using different sections of the lights. So it's split up into eight different sections, and that gives you a lot of flexibility, which you can use through the shows and also sound to light. That's another thing that you can do with yeah. this, which is gonna be a big boon for most DJs. Yeah, 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 for sure. And easy to set up as well in terms of like, well, obviously with sound to light. Um, very, yeah, very, very simple. Ve very very simple. simple. And, you know, people that are familiar with like all the rest of the Equinox lights and yep. stuff, it's a similar, or, or is it the, the, the same like control panel? on the? Yeah, on? yeah, it's very, very similar. I would say it's probably like most lighting fixtures. It's dead simple. You've got menu, you've got enter, you've got up and down. So mm -hmm. you can go through all of the different shows that you're going to do. Yep. Very, very simple. And through the shows, what it's using is 224 LED light sources. So yeah. it's really quite extensive. A lot of light in there. It yeah. can go very, very bright and you can use it in a number of different ways as I've already said. So I'm thinking about attaching onto poles where you've got either speakers or lighting gantries, mm -hmm. behind scrims and front covers of mobile DJ stands. Yep. Really great use for that. I know I'm definitely looking for one for one of my, <laughs> one of my booths. Yeah. Um, and also you can use them as up lighters and you'll be able to give a bit of texture to a room because we use bars to up light rooms all the time. And with these, what you're going to do is be able to just give it more interest rather than just a static light or slowly changing colours. This will slowly change colours or quickly change colours depending on how you want to do it in a much more interesting way yeah. than normal. So 54 interesting 54 ways. 54 interesting <laughs> ways. And, but of course, and nine different speeds. Right, there you go. But within those 54 different modes then, can you change like where, where they, uh, like the different LEDs along? Um, yes. And, yes. And all those bits. And that's yeah. where... Yeah, that's where a DMX, where controller, DMX controller comes controller into comes it. From, yeah? So you can control it through DMX in a number of different ways. You've got three channel mode, five, 24, 48, mm -hmm. and 53, I believe it is. So quite a lot of different ways that you can do it. All you do is just plug in your DMX lead, which I've got here. And then we can then control individual parts of the lights. There you go. So a lot of flexibility. I should have got most of them up. Yes. Yeah, there you go. So, so yeah, you can control, oh, like that's how we've got this program into the DMX. But then yeah. if you had a bigger DMX controller, you could then program all of the different 
54 lighting modes into a DMX controller. Uh, yeah. Am I right or am I far yeah. off it, No, no. If you're using the 53 different DMX channels, then yeah. what you've got is an ability to run through everything that it will do from a DMX controller. Yeah. So perfect for, you know, someone that maybe brings, well, either someone that can multitask while they're DJing or someone that yeah. brings their yeah. own sort of yeah. lighting jock or, or, or yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah. So you can, you can build a lighting show around it using, using these lights to supplement what you've got at the moment. Um, or you can do, which is what I suspect a lot of mobile DJs will do, certainly I will be doing, is putting them in sound to light and just letting them go with their own thing because yeah. they're really, really, really effective. But when they're in sound to light, as long as they're connected together, they'll do the same thing, right? So yes, master slave mode is yep. available on these, definitely. It will work in a master slave with these lights, the same lights. It doesn't work with the older batons. No, that is actually something which we checked out earlier. Um, so yeah, we, well, are we sure that it works or not? I mean, we couldn't get it to work. No, we couldn't get it to um, work. No. And, and I say that, Pete can get it to work. I mean, yeah, I, yeah, I, I, yeah, I haven't got, yeah. really got a clue. Thanks for that, that thanks for that. But. Um, but yeah, yeah, so so they work perfectly with each other. They work perfectly with each other, but master slave for different light fixtures generally don't work together anyway because they are different light fixtures. Yeah. And we thought maybe with the older baton that that this light is replacing, maybe it might work. But I suspect it won't because the other one is two hundred and forty LEDs and this is right two hundred and twenty four. So yeah. I suspect that's probably it. Plus this is just much newer technology. Yeah. So speaking about the LEDs then, uh this this baton here has got the see-through um, bit on the front. So it's got the clear perspex, yeah. The, yeah. the clear perspex, so yeah. you can see kind of the LEDs on that one. Yeah. Uh, but this one here has got the frosted Correct. Um, LED, yeah. Uh, yeah. the frosted perspex on the front, which is this one here. Yep. Yeah. Um, so you can basically, you, so, so if you want it in, in this effect, which I actually think that this is, well, it is quite blatantly brighter. Yes, um, yeah, it is brighter. But this is more of a subtle, yep. you know, kind, yeah, 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 kind of vibe yeah, here. Yeah. Um, but it's very easy just to just to sw switch them over. Yes. Um, yeah. So all you're doing is you're taking a plate off of the off of one of the sides. Yep. Four screws, slide out the the cover. Yep. And then put in the other one. Put in the other it one. It takes in. it takes minutes. And then you put the plate back on top. Yeah. To put it back in. Yeah. 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 Um, so. It obviously, so, so these batons come with both of these. Yes, the it comes options. with both of them and it comes with handy brackets as well so that you can put that up to any trussing or rigging that you need to do. Yep. So it has pretty much everything it does. The, the feet, only thing it the doesn't feet, come with. It doesn't with come yet. with these feet. It mm -hmm. doesn't come with these feet, although these are available. They are £10 each yep. and Ten. available from DJ Kit. Of course, of course. And uh, those feet will fit any of the any batons with, with the screw hole in the end. Yeah. So so they're so they'll fit the old ones. Yep. Uh, yep as, absolutely. as well. Yeah. So so yeah, ten pounds for the feet guys not included, but you do get the two options of either the frosted LED um or the uh see through LED uh sorry, the frosted um perspex or the um see through perspex there, and it does come with the clamps. Um so, I mean, mate, yeah, f f for the price of them, I think that they're going to be really powerful. £75 pounds each. It's 75, an absolute at, steal. At the point of this video. Absolute steal. So, at the, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, okay. <laughs> at, at the point yeah. of this video, £75. Pound, but, yeah. yeah, I mean, sort of, even if you put one of them, like, yeah. you know, yeah. un underneath. I mean, so earlier on, we did actually put um, one of them standing. Yes. Um, in front of a DJ booth. Yeah, yeah. And one of them um, using the clamps on, on the front of a DJ booth. We did, yeah. Just to, just to kind of show what, what it can look like. And we run them th with uh, sound to light. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, li little example of how that kind of looks. Really, really powerful. Obviously, like backwards, the, the, the way that we set it up, not yeah. facing the crowd. That was kind yeah, of facing yeah, where, yeah. where the DJ yeah, would be stood. But, um, but, yeah, really powerful stuff. You know, un under a scrim, um, on the front of DJ booth. I mean, do you, is there a limit of how many of these you can connect up together? No, not well. There, there is, but uh, it, it's not really feasible to even think about. There's so many right. of them because you can put so ma so many of them together. So the, the limit would be your bank account, basically. Yeah, I would say so. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, but um, but yeah. So I mean, that's basically in a nutshell the Spectra Pix baton from uh, from Equinox. Fabulous bit of kit. Yeah, indeed. Really, really good. Pete, thank you so much, mate. You're welcome. You're well, a welcome. pleasure. First time in the Rat Cave. Yeah, hope, I know. Hope, bit, <laughs> bit, a bit unusual for me, I've got to say. <laughs> Hopefully it won't thought be I'd the be last. Here. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, guys, so these are available now from DJ Kit. Um, like we said, 
uh, the 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 legs here they don't come with the actual baton itself so so make sure that if if you want this standing up um, baton like, like this make sure that you order the um, the, the little uh, stand for four leg stands as well so uh, yeah thanks very much for watching guys I'll catch you next time peace <laughs>